this is pi over pi plus pi over pi hexa to the pi times pi to the power of pi hexa to the pi it is a really great approximation of e. This mean is a, this is a math mean derived by someone who jokingly wanted to create an extreme level precision using pi. They crafted the expression by making each component cancel out to make the formula the formula one plus one over x to the x. They get x as large as possible, which is pi hex to the pi. They use nth up arrow notation with pi to get x insanely large. So they're trying to create a very great approximation of e by using pi. Here are detail. This approximation is extreme. It means that x is, there's this formula 1 plus 1 over x to the power of x, the bigger the x, the closer the e. But, but things cancel out, the pi in the numerator and the denominator. So that's, we get the formula. But now pi is, well, x is pi hexated to pi. So x is so huge, it would lead to, to the approximation being pretty much e. It works out because the, it leads to that formula. Things cancel out. And x gets very big, again, with the hexation with pi calculation. I mean, I mean by calculating the exact file, the value of pi hexated to pi, we're using we somehow have to calculate hexation to non-integers using pi, that which is approximately 3.14159265358. So more in, in, in somehow you have a non-integer base and non-integer height, which breaks down to something. In fact, this, anyways, it's supposed to result in a crazy number because pi is greater than 3, and 3 hex to 3 is already insane. Beyond, if you want to get an even better approximation, well, you could add more arrows. It gets an even more precise and precise, even closer to E. But it's pointless because the approximation is pretty much close, pretty much E at this point. Well, I would like to for you to hear my version because I would love to share this. Here it is. This expression involves x being so big in this thing. It's pi arrow with pi arrows to pi, but then that determines the number of arrows in the next one which determines the number of arrows in the next one, and so on. I repeat that process pi times. Here is a comparison of their formula and my formula. They're pretty much both E. These, in this formula, 1 plus 1 over x to the x, x is so large that it will be put, equal to e nearly but probably but, but technically not equal to e this my expression could, could technically be called much closer to e than the other one let me know your version of this